When we hear wild cats, most of us think about lions, tigers, and leopards. But what are all the other types of wild cats out there? Did you hear about the grumpiest cat, the cat known as King of Sand, or the fishing cat Master of Water? If you consider yourself a cat person or simply curious, let's get acquainted today with unique representatives of these wild, smaller cat species. Sand Cat Deserts One of the harshest ecosystems on Earth. The largest desert on the planet, African Sahara, known for extreme heat and drought, is home to these magnificent, superbly adaptable animals. With summer days scorching temperatures of 40 degrees Celsius and winter nights, temperatures can drop past negative 20. Animals inhabiting these sandy and stony places far from water sources specialize in the extreme. One of these special desert animals is a cat. Yes, a cat and it's a small fur ball called sand cat. These wild animals thrive in deserts of North Africa, Southwest and Central Asia. Moving low to the ground, their beige thick fur blends with the sand, showcasing wonderful camouflage with nature. With this ability to disguise, living in low densities and with almost no footprints, they are nearly impossible to see by day and challenging to track by night. Due to extreme sunlight in deserts, sand temperature can go up to 80 degrees Celsius or more. So, they burn their paws? No, not really. Sand cats have long fur covering their paws, protecting them from scorching hot sand. Thick fur protects them from these high temperatures during the day and also low temperatures at night. This small solitary cat is a nocturnal hunter. During the day they are napping underground burrows that hide from prying eyes. Their tiny bodies weigh no more than between three to seven pounds or one to three kilograms. So sand cats can easily slip under small bushes for some shade. How do they live without water? These wonderful, resilient cats do not need water to live. They rarely, if ever, drink water, relying on the prey they eat for their water intake. That was interesting, but the next cat will blow your mind. The palace's cat. Central Asia and its vast expanses of steppes and mountains is home to this small wild cat, Palace's cat. This unique looking cat is more than just a funny furry face with a characteristically stocky build and flat forehead. Fluffy ears on each side of their furry head give me that signature cute but grumpy look. Although the name Otocolobus itself means ugly-eared in Greek, I cannot fully agree with this description. These small, fluffy ears set low on their heads come in handy when cats are hiding so they can peer over rocks while keeping their ears hidden. That specific look plays an important role, especially if you're a poor runner like this cat. For ambushing prey, your best weapon is disguise. Palace's cats have a wide diet, but they primarily prey on small mammals, including rodents, lagomorphs, and pikas. However, they have been known to prey on birds and lizards, hunting during dusk and dawn to avoid their own predators like eagles and foxes. In addition to this unusual appearance and expressive face, it differs from other cats in one other way, eyes. If we look closely, unlike other cats, the pupils of Pallas's cats contract into small circles rather than vertical slits. Maybe this is the main reason for their human-like expressive faces. 
Palace's cats may look chubby and plush, but it is all their gray fluff. Their puffy fur coat keeps them warm in extreme temperatures, and it is the densest fur of any cat in the world. Due to these temperature conditions, estrus, or the period in which the female is fertile, lasts mind-blowingly one to two days a year. Despite appearances, they are quite small, about the size of a domestic cat, with larger ones weighing around four kilograms or nine pounds. Since they are extremely solitary animals with a large territory, they are very difficult to find. Sometimes they have difficulty finding each other during breeding season. Nature is so versatile, so be ready to meet. Fishing Cat Water and cats usually do not go together, or do they? The fishing cat is a medium-sized wild cat of South and Southeast Asia, including Sri Lanka and parts of Pakistan. They are attracted to all types of water and live in wetlands, their most common stomping ground with marshes, swamps, and mangroves also high on the list of suitable habitats. In the small cat world, these fishing cats are quite large, with males being much larger than females and weighing 8 to 17 kilograms or 18 to 37 pounds. This short, stocky body allows them to swim like a pro or wrestle larger fish out of the water. Unlike other felines, they have a fairly short tail and paws with webbing between the toes to help with swimming and muddy lifestyle. These adaptable creatures are the only members of the cat family specializing in fish. Other cats can eat a fish here and there, but fishing cats got their name for a reason. Quietly waiting by the water's edge, watching the movement calmly with a focus to catch sight of their next meal. Of course, they don't use a fishing pole. Instead, the cats wade into shallow water and use their paws to scoop fish out, or they dive headfirst into deeper areas to catch a meal with their teeth. Quite impressive. Although fishing cats mainly eat fish, they will hunt anything near the water. Little is known about fishing cats in the wilderness, but it is thought that they have no natural predators other than humans. But we know that humans can sometimes be the biggest problem. Endangered fishing cat faces an uphill battle. It has been estimated that about 50% of Southeast Asia wetlands are disappearing as the human population grows. Their habitat is being cleared for more agriculture and human infrastructure. These wetland areas are affected by pollution, over-farming, and the use of chemical fertilizers that drain into wetlands, overfishing by humans, and drainage issues. And sadly, yes, there are poachers also. It is very difficult to spot fish cats in the wild. So maybe that is why people are not even familiar with this mysterious, beautiful animal. But some people are making a difference. Fishing Cat Conservancy, finding a way to people and children of India and Sri Lanka by learning, protecting, and educating. In hope that we will find love for our furry friends, fish cats. Wild cats are majestic creatures, aren't they? Support us by subscribing to the channel. Leave a like and comment. World Cut.